Okay, here we are, back at The Last of Us. Now we're heading off to find Robert. Robert, you bastard. He tried to kill Tess, so we're going to go and um, correct his manners, I guess. You see, where I come from, hey, if you try to kill Same someone, that's considered bad yeah, manners. It's clear. I just used it. Okay, no so no patrols. patrols. Cool, cool, cool. Apparently, um, <laughs> it's just normal to walk around outside. Uh, Marlene? She's been asking around, trying to find him. Marlene? What do the Fireflies need with Robert? Good question. I think she'd tell me. Well, what did you tell her? The truth. I got no idea where he's hiding. Good man. Hey, you stay out of trouble, alright? Military's gonna be out in force soon. Yeah, see you around. Yeah, because of all the, you know, murderizing. I wonder how much they intervene with, uh, I guess, civil affairs. Marlene looking for Robert? What do you make of that? I suppose oh, if, you, <laughs> if you find a trail of dead bodies, then you're gonna wanna ask some questions, aren't you? It must come a time in this scenario when the military decide it's no longer in their best interest to protect people. And then you can, especially like the world has ended. And then where do you go from there, I suppose? Signs of military or infected. I don't know, sign of infected. Cool. Um, famous last words, I guess. <laughs> See that, for instance, here. Um, we never go outside. But look how well it's decorated. You've got a little barbecue there. You've got graffiti all over the walls. You've got rubble on the floor. You've even got a little hatch there to go into a, like an underground cellar. Bins. You see what I mean? This. Oh, okay. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry, Tess. Um, it's just that level of extra detail, which I guess makes it a, like a timeless classic. I can't see this game ever getting old, even when the graphics are considered, you know, poor. It's definitely going to be up there, you know. Although, if that day ever comes. <laughs> oh, God, this place reeks. Oh, God. I, need to wash and throw away I can't see anything. Um, oh, okay, so the lights are on. So have some power then. Where's all the petrol there? You've got to admit, petrol must be running short. I doubt they've got oil rigs. <laughs> that would be a surprise, wouldn't it? Oh, yeah, the military. They've got oil rigs, refineries. Still here from last time. Right, come on. Pick up that gear. See, I quite like this gun. I'm not a lot of ammo. I'd much rather upgrade a pistol than upgrade an AK-47. Which I, I don't actually know if there is an assault rifle in this game. Boom. Right, R2 to reload. Boost me up. Okay, let's boost tests up. Let's boost her up. I love the, um, the dual... Uh, character mechanics as well. Come on, Tess, let me up. Come on. Ah, yo. Ready, who? Okay, let's get out. Was it that easy to get out of the quarantine zone? Okay. <laughs> the effect of they're definitely not gonna find that, are they? Be careful. When am I not? <laughs> that a trick question. Ooh, there's a kitchen back here. And now I wanna find all the upgrades and I'm not too fussed about the collectibles. I'm never really a big collectible collectible <laughs> collectible fan. Um uh, I think it's just a bit monotonous monotonous, really. Um although at least the uh upgrades it's actually have a use. Shape. Well, I am the romantic type. you damn right you are, Joel. I mean, <laughs> you're the most romantic, romantic guy. Romantic? God, what is wrong with me today? Romantic guy I know. Yeah, I'm a bit tongue-tied today. Where's the ladder? There's right, the ladder. Um, I know where the ladder is. It's down here, isn't it? Uh, cool. Foliage. Got it. Brilliant foliage. Great, bring it over. Okay, so, uh, tutorial unlocked, press the... I don't even know what button that is, to be honest with you. Okay, there we go. Ladies first. That ladder is too hey, vertical <laughs> for my down. sensibilities. It needs to be pulled back this ever so slightly. This way. It feels like you're going to fall backwards when you climb up it. I love how old everything looks. But would it get this beaten up after only 20 years? I mean, I know the windows are all broken, and well, I suppose in this instance, with the giant wall, hole in the wall and stuff. 
like the weather's going to get to you or we'll get to the building so but a lot of other places they just seem really worn out okay anything here Ooh, weapon parts i like weapon parts okay so we've got us i think yeah there's a there's a firefly emblem here or pendant rather oh look cool little hands everywhere and the names under them i wonder if this was a uh, part of the quarantine zone before like a nursery or something. It's just, it's just so much interesting now things to discover. I feel like I'm sucking the game's deck a little bit. <laughs> be better. Okay. Once we get our merchandise back, it should be easy to unload. Speaking of merchandise, Ooh. when's that next shipment due? We're well, meeting Bill next month. More pills, lots of ammo. Supposedly. Yeah, we're gonna meet Bill. Spores. Oh, lovely. Apparently you can see spores before you walk through them, which is a <laughs> an interesting thing. Where the hell are all these coming from? The place was clear. This is what I was talking about earlier. Um, like the infected die, and this happens. So <laughs> you either need to burn the infected really quickly. There's our culprit. Yeah, look. Um, otherwise, they start spreading spores everywhere, and then that whole area becomes unusable. Oh, look! God, it's gross. It's really interesting though. This is there's actually um, a type of fungus that exists that does this to ants. I guess that's probably where they get their inspiration. Oh Christ! You okay? Where they got their inspiration yeah. from. Damn ceiling's falling apart. Be careful. This way. Okay. Easy. <laughs> that was me. Oh jeez. Oh, he's still alive. My mask broke. If it was me, I'd be wearing my mask 24-7. Yeah, you did. Just put him out of his minery. Mi minery? <laughs> Misery. See what I mean? I'm really tongue-tied today. Okay, so... There's going to be infected around, isn't there? Um, I would guess if he was there, then his friends are probably going to be as well. Uh, where am I going, anyway? Up ahead. You hear that? Shh, shh. Ah, okay. Right. Okay, so I want to focus Joel's hearing. Okay, so I play a very <laughs> unique game, okay? I'm sometimes quite good at stealth, and about 50% of the time it works for me. <laughs> the other 50% of the time I fuck up within the first five minutes, or like the first enemy I see. So, um, it's a bit hit and miss. I guess, c can we, can we double team this one? Uh, apparently not. Oh Christ! Right, so I don't. Even, <laughs> I actually think we need to. Oh, Jesus! There we go. I don't know where the other infected is. All oh, right, okay. <laughs> Tess is handling it. That's fine. Thing is, Tess can't die. So, <laughs> I sometimes outsource some of the killing to other people. Although I find that the um, the allies don't do half as much damage as you do. And they tend to just kind of hold an enemy in place. Right, so, we want to just have a quick look around, see if we can find anything. Ooh, hello. Um, ammo is abysmal. Ammo is really hard to come by in this game. And they do a great job of limiting the amount of ammo you can carry. Because um, last thing you... Realistically, you can only really carry a clip or two, can't you? I mean, you're not going to walk around with, like, 50 clips of ammo like you do in Call of Duty and stuff. I mean, Jesus Christ. Ammo's heavy, and <laughs> where the hell are you going to put it all? So, um, yeah, I mean, you're limited to what ammo you can carry for which gun. So it limits your possibilities. You can't just go gun ho everywhere. Although I've got a few tricks to kind of manage crowds, which uh, we'll get to eventually. Ooh, yummy. Right, so it's a note. Um, this is about Smuggler. They got infected trying to sneak into the zone. I'll, um, I'll show the notes if you want to read them, just pause the screen. Um, I won't read them all out though, because otherwise we'll be here forever. Here we go. We're safe. Turn the flashlight off. Or torch, however you want to call it. Fresh air. That's the one thing I love about Oh, I guess they erected those walls? 
That makes sense. Right through, through like a neighborhood as well. Hey, they weren't expired. That'd be a good idea. Cool. I guess in theory, it would it'd be quicker to erect the walls around like a highly like building, like with place of lots of buildings. Sorry. But then there are going to be so many holes to patch. I guess hence why they're able to just kind of walk in and out whenever they want to. Okay. It looks like a like a warehouse or something. Especially the metal floors. Anything down there? Doesn't look like it. Right. Oh, Christ, wrong button. Damn it. Plank fell down. Right, so we have to get the plank so we can cross. Um, I get this is mainly just tutorial stuff, isn't it? Getting to um, some sort of understanding of how the game works, which I think they do quite well. Here, pass it to me. <laughs> I'm not going to climb up that, am I? <laughs> up the plank. Uh, let's just put this down. Cool. It's a bit heavy. Tis tad. It. All right. He grunts a lot as well, which is really off-putting when you're carrying big planks and ladders and stuff, especially the ladder, because not being funny, but aluminium ladders, they're not heavy. A piece of wood probably could be. It depends on what wood it is. If a piece of pine, it's not going to. Okay. I don't think there's a lot to see around here, um, other than just obviously visuals, but a lot to collect in the early game, is there? Now me, I've probably missed like 12 secrets already. Right, let's follow Tess. It would be nice if you could run a bit faster, though. Although, maybe running around, like, like full pelt everywhere, doesn't really make a lot of sense. You just kind of, like, leisurely jog. Okay, here we go. So it's in and out, really, isn't it? Cool, let's get in. Come on, Tess. Shut it. Well, duh. Right, can we find anything? I think at this point it's mainly just health and pistol bullets. But I'll be happy ha bleh, I'll be happy with either uh handgun really. Yeah, I'm sure we'll need it. Cool. Oh, hello. Bullets. Why would somebody just leave that there? Right, let's just reload. That's a full clip then. Hey little man. <laughs> Is that his job then? I suppose it would make kind of sense, wouldn't it? He gets paid no with food. Soldiers, none of Robert's men, yeah? You know he's expecting us. Well, that'll make it more interesting. <laughs> Come on. Let's go. Good to go. Come on. The worst thing in the world is relying on NPCs to open doors for you. So get the frickin' door open. So look, this is an example of what I was talking about. Um, Not right now, Terrence. All this area, just lovely decorated. You're never going to come down here. Unless you went the wrong way. Ah, oh, that's intimidating, isn't it? <laughs> look at him. Poor little kid. Oh, that guy looks rough. What are you selling, lady? Um, shoes? I guess clothes. You. Hurry up. We're starving. Keep your shirt on. Next batch coming right up. Hey, don't even think about cutting in line. Fucking A. Yeah, that's gross. So, um, <laughs> they're basically crowding around the table ready to eat rats. You touch it, you buy it. Fuck off. <laughs> oh, God. It's a rough world, isn't it? I certainly wouldn't want to live here. Malik, sit back down. Oh, sorry, Tess. Didn't realize you two were together. Go ahead. Who's that? An old headache. Don't ask. An old headache. Or oh, what if they dated? Um, which way do we go then? Um, I think we go here, don't we? Yeah. I'm looking for Robert. You come through here? Half hour ago. He went back to the wharf. He's there now. Where's she got those ration cards? It didn't look like she had that many. Now she's just basically giving them all away. <laughs> right. Rise up. Look for the lights. I like how the, the paint is it's like it's ultraviolet or something. Come on, let's go, Tess. 
Oh, thugs. Here we go. Who's this guy then? Let us through. You guys need to turn around and head back if you know what's good for you. Our beef isn't with you. We just want Robert. You don't want to do this. Turn the fuck around and leave now. I'm not going anywhere without Robert. Bitch, I will bash your skull unless you turn around and get your dumb ass out of here. Fuck this. <laughs> Take cover! <laughs> Fucking hell, Tess. You are so yeah. zero bullshit, aren't you? I'll cover you. Get the angle on them. Okay, come on. Oh, in a dick. Ah, come on, man. There we go. Oh, I need some work on my aim a little bit. You do. Could do with some more. Um, what are these wanted posters? Oh, okay. That's weird. Right, believe in the fireflies. Okay, so I guess they're just like revolutionaries or I guess terrorists, you could call them. Depending on your outlook, I suppose, isn't it? Freedom fighters or terrorists? That is for you to decide. Give me your hand. Okay, cool. I thought he was going to open the gate, but never mind. <laughs> it's like, oh look, a locked gate. I guess I go no further. Right, let's go, Joel. Let's go kick some poo nanny. So you guys excited for The Last of Us 2? I know I am. Right, here we go. I guess we go through this little hole. Over here, Joel. Yep, let's go through. More of Robert's guys. How do you Man. know they're coming? Two of our guys died trying to take Tess out. I guarantee that she and Joel are on their way here right now to get Robert. Jesus. Two? I thought it was three of their guys. Um, unless maybe one of them Let's wasn't there, guys. Sure no one's right, okay, so I'm just gonna kind of wait for them to... Right, so she's taken out him. Um, we need to... God. I would like the option to hide bodies, because they do get alerted for when they find other bodies. Right, so I guess, I think they're gonna talk. Um, I know this part. And then I'll take this guy out. He's the outlier. Oh, don't turn around, don't turn around. Like, you're dead. You can shoot them. Um, <laughs> it's kind of pointless, really. If you shoot them, um, <laughs> then everybody's alerted. Okay, so we've got two guys. Um, we're going to go for a double takedown. Got one guy there and one guy here. I meant to tell you. I think they have a little chat. I know where Tess has gone. Where's Tess gone? Let's find out. Uh, L1? Isn't it? Yeah, okay. Yes. Right, so Tess is Firefly. ready by the door to yeah. come in and take this guy out. Him up the wall. Bang, bang. And they're looking at each other. We need them to not be looking at each other. Shit. Okay, so... Okay, here we go. <laughs> there we go. I should have done that, really. I should have saved the ammo, but... Um, to be honest with you, I've never actually used the gun. I've always ever used a shiv or, um, yeah, or, like, strangled them. But I figured, seeing as that was the last two people, I'd give it a shot. So it's health. Uh, I don't think I'm going to find any more ammo. Cool. All right, then. Okay, so we've got the warehouse now. No, right, so we know we're low on ammo, so it's encouraging us to use other items, like uh, this bottle. Okay. Okay, so three of them had an RPG, <laughs> just saying. Um, and there are more of them upstairs, I do believe. But immediately, there are three. Um, I think one of them's going to come in, isn't he? What I can do. I can grab this bugger. Move him over. So nobody sees and then strangle the bastard. That way no one's gonna see. See, I always assume that when you strangle them, it's non-lethal. 
because strangling someone doesn't oh, actually yeah. kill them, believe it or not. Yeah. Um, you have to continue to strangle them after they've passed out or snap their neck or like crush their trachea. Um, but maybe he does. I don't know. The guy's quite violent, isn't he? Okay, so we're looking at just that guy down there. Oh, no, wait. Is there someone in there? Um, right, okay. That's fine. That's fine, that's fine, that's fine. I guess we get this guy next. Oh, no. See, if I use a bottle, it will alert more than one person, right? So I'm really good at that. I think what I'll do is I'll go upstairs. Wait that guy for a minute. Okay. Let's not go up on the side. Let's go behind. We'll pull him back and murderize him. Just so we, nobody sees us. Come on. Come on. Come on. And down you go. Shh, 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 shh. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. That's okay. okay. That's fine. Um, okay, there's two guys here. And one down there. Oh, God. Where is he? Oh, Christ. Oh, shit. Oh, why did I grab him? Right, was the others alerted? Were the others alerted? Uh, yes, yes they were. Oh well, we'll have to, uh, I guess, shoot some people. See, this is what always happens. Someone always inevitably sneaks up behind me. Oh dear. <laughs> oh god. Right, we're going to get runner. Apparently, people love to die. Uh, takes three shots, between, like a normal enemy, or with this gun. The later pistol takes two, but you carry less ammo, so. Ooh! Sucks to be you, man. Sorry, I think that's everyone. Okay, so it's a health kit, very nice. More people. They just slow us down. They just yeah. slow us down. Right. Let's just double check this next room a minute. Come on, the docks are this way. Right, docks are that way. Ooh, a ship. Yeah, it's a, it's a quick way to take the enemies down because a lot of the time, it's more to with the uh, infected. You need them for clickers. Because um, if you leave a body just lying around, they're going to get um, privy to you anyway. But it's just a nice quick takedown because strangling takes a little while. Okay, we'll leave it there. Um, we're going to go to the docks next and we're going to take down... Uh, Robert? It was Robert, wasn't it? Um, but yeah, uh, anyway, thanks for watching, and I'll catch you next time. Ciao!